Hello everybody and welcome to this crucial semi-final match. I'm Mark Nicholas and it's a pleasure to be here with you for today's crunch game. This is a batsman's pitch. I'm amazed that he's chosen to bowl first. It's firm, there's no real covering of grass. I think the bounce will be even. I'd expect a lot of runs today. Two impressive lineups on view today. Let's have a look at the first of them. Welcome back. The players and the umpires have made their way to the middle. Everybody's set for the second innings, and it really is difficult to choose a winner. Let's pick up commentary now with Richie Bennett. That's good judgment. No need to play at that. Four wides to India. Four wides. That's the worst result for anybody. Well, I won't like that one little bit. Oh, he really laid into that delivery for all the way. Got him. Yes, he's out. Lovely catch. He's got a great pair of hands. He is so strong through the cover, strong and so precise too. Beautifully played. You couldn't imagine anything better. Hopeful shout, and the batsman was easily in. Just one run. Oh, oh good shot. Saw it early, got in position quickly, and nailed it. Well, that's perfection. Didn't try to hit it too hard, just, just stroked it away. side for any bowler. The ball is just sailing over the fence. He gave that a bit of Larry Dooley. A great stroke. My goodness, this guy can play. What a pleasure to watch him, too. The bowling side can now have up to five players outside the inner ring. That's edge and out. That was a big deflection, no doubt about it. Fielded by the man at long on. There's uh, just one there. Played. Well played, my favourite stroke. The on-drive, it's a difficult stroke to play, but he met it with the full face of the bat, and if you've got your feet in the right position, you won't go far wrong. That was a shot straight out of the coaching manual. We're gonna... The sweeper picks up.
That's two more runs on the board. Bond continues. Well, the trouble with bowling there is that it's his favourite area, and he'll hammer you every time. Enjoyed that perfectly timed and four from the moment it left the back. They've turned that into two, that's good running. Played into the gap. That was a very anxious moment for the batsman there. Pushed into the gap. Fielded by the man at long on. He looked as if he was home to me. They've turned that into two, that's good running. He's got it into the gap. They've been playing well and on current form, they do have what it takes to lift the trophy. Doesn't need to play at those. That's been given as a wide. Yes. That's turned away through mid wicket. Yeah. They've turned that into two, that's good running. Not a good judge of a run, is he? That brings up his half century. by the man at long on. I think he was easily back in the crease there. That takes him into double figures. long on. The field is appeal but uh, he was quite comfortably home. The batsmen changed their mind. Miles! 
Miles. He's in it. Miles. Stopped in the covers. Franks is going to try over the wicket. He's worked that into the gap. It's the hardest thing to win a semi-final, but they've done it. They've pulled it off when it most mattered. Congratulations to everybody in this terrific side. And didn't they feel that of their skin today? The catching was top class, the ground fielding quite brilliant. On behalf of Richie Benno and myself, Mark Nicholas, we bid you a good afternoon and look forward to bringing you more cricket coverage in the very near future. Bye-bye for now.